These are my top 5 scary TV shows ever made, and I'll be explaining all of them in one video going in reverse order. So we'll be saving the best for last. Coming in at number 5 is a show that I think is very, very underrated, Salem. It begins with Mary Sibley, a powerful witch who controls Salem while also scheming to summon the devil for an ancient ritual. This is of course loosely inspired by the Salem Witch Trials of 1692, but I think it adds its own unique twist. At number 4, we have a show that I went in with no expectations for, but I ended up loving it. Jew on Origins is a miniseries that shows you the backstory of the very famous horror movie The Grudge. It was just the right amount of terrifying and interesting, and I thought it tied into the history of The Grudge Curse very well. But now it's time for the top 3. These three shows are not only interesting, but I consider them near perfect works of art. So without further ado, number 3 goes to a show that I can literally talk about all day. Midnight Mass begins with Riley coming out of prison after accidentally unaliving someone in a car accident. And because of his crime, he loses his faith in God. But after he's released, he returns to his very small and very religious hometown. And that's when he notices the new priest is hiding something terrifying from everyone else in town. Moving on to number two, this is a show that scared the hell out of me. Ratchet is about a nurse who tries to rescue her brother who's being held in a mental asylum after unaliving multiple priests. One thing I personally loved about this show is how it contrasts very bright and beautiful colors with a deeply disturbing plot. And now for the number one spot. This is not only my favorite show, but my favorite thing I've ever watched in any genre in any format. It's pretty much perfect, there's nothing wrong with it, 100 out of 10. The Haunting of Hill House. This show will make you feel every single emotion. It'll make you cry, smile, scream, all of it. Also, a side note, the fact that two of the shows in my top three are by Mike Flanagan really says something. Please go watch everything that man has ever made, all of it is amazing, especially this show. Let me know if I should do another top five list and follow for more.